really did become one of the voices of the post-punk generation, his big break came in the late 70s at one particular club in Leeds, The Warehouse. There was no other club like it in the north of England. People came from all, all over around to go to The Warehouse. It was, amaz it was an amazing place. So I started becoming a DJ around that time. So I, I, I've already got, got my foot in the door. I think Mike, the owner of the, of the warehouse, knew we, where I'd started this band, Soft Cell. And he heard, saw the, the rate of how emer electronic music was emerging and coming up, was becoming big around the north of England. They call themselves the Young Romantics, or the New Romantics, or at least that's the title that's given to them. But take one look at the costumes they're wearing, and I think you might agree that that's the understatement of the year. Richard Mabley did his first TV interview with me at the warehouse, um, which is probably there on YouTube somewhere. <laughs> I think the whole thing is just about being sort of, sort of and people being individuals and just having a good time and, and dressing up and enjoying themselves. So then non-stop erotic cabaret comes out. It's massive. Were you prepared for that? Not really, no. It was, 